Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Teresa Ellen Arianis, TEA, and this is Tea Time Adventures on YouTube. Come closer, my YouTube family, and let me tell you the tale of Goldie Boxed and the Three Little Bears. Well, actually, there's a fourth bear, but we'll just start with the first three. <laughs> this is a relatively new subscription box out in subscription box world. It's been around since, I believe, fall of 2020, and it was created and curated by Jessica of Everything Proof Beauty. I will have the links down below in the description box. And um, I know I'd seen her, uh, some of her videos, especially when she did Fab Fit Fun uh, Battles with Catherine McCarty. And um, she must have gotten every subscription box under the sun of all different varieties and still found something wanting. So she decided to create and curate her own subscription box. Now, there are three basic levels to the Goldie Box. Uh, and the first one is a Bronze Bear. And with that, you get three customized items that you can choose from at certain levels. And then a fourth item that is curated by, specifically by the Goldie Box team. That is $29.99 a quarter. The next is the Silver Bear, where you get five customized items and an additional two items that are curated by the team and that is $44.99 and the last is the gold bear the big daddy which is seven customizable items three bonus items and it's $59.99 now there is a fourth bear and that is surprise bear <laughs> Surprise Bear is three items from across that season's products um, that is curated completely by the team, and it is $21.99. So I have gotten into this um, just because this is not the first time I've tried to film this, but then the phone rings. So um, I have done a little bit of research and I have peaked, so I'll, I'll uh, go ahead and get into the box right now. I love that it has such beautiful tissue paper. What is it with me and butterflies this week? I've got to tell you, it's a sign. <laughs> All right, it comes um, with a little pamphlet of the items that are in uh, the whole season. Um, and then what's in my box is what I have spe specifically have picked and what's been curated for me. So we'll go ahead and dive right in. Uh, the first thing that I see on top is a little candle. It's very unique in its little bubble design. I don't know what the scent is. I think I would have preferred to have it unscented, but it's mild, so it's not going to set off my allergies. Um, Light vanilla scented candle, two and a half inch bubble cube design. It does not smell like vanilla. <laughs> it smells more floral actually than vanilla, um, but it is very cute. It is very pretty blue and I'm definitely happy to have it and try it out. Um, the retail value of this is $15. So they're made in small batches. So it is an artisanal uh, candle, so handmade. Next item is, oh, I see candy. <laughs> I somehow don't think that this is part of my choice. I think this is just a sweet surprise. Chocolate confetti. It's a party in your mouth with these tiny drops of creamy milk chocolate in a rainbow candy shell made in Greece. Oh, and it's got a nice little acetate container um, that can be reused for beads, jewelry, all sorts of things. So this is very cute. I like the fact that once the candy is gone, I can still reuse this. Next item up is a bottle opener. Now this bottle opener is made from recycled uh, vinyl records. So it does have the label on it. Um, and each one of us would be getting a different one that is unique because it is from a record. It is a way to um, reutilize 
and repurpose these vinyl records um, in a way that's still beautiful and decorative. It is, I believe, stainless steel on the back, so it is going to last. Um, and this must have been from Columbia Records. My name is Barbara Two T W O. Um, I don't know if you can see that with, but I love the fact I love music. So, and I actually don't have a bottle opener, so this was for me the perfect choice. And it's um, since this is a lifestyle and beauty subscription, I chose this over some of the other items. So I'm quite happy with this, and I think it's just so cool and so unique. Um, the retail value of the bottle opener is $12. Next item is by a company called Cell, C-E-L, Micro Stem Hair Thickening Mask, 4 ounces, paraben and sulfate free, cruelty free, that's always a plus. Um, let's see, hair mask. Micro Stem Hair Thickening Mask gets vegan and cruelty free, pre prevents hair loss, and promotes hair growth and thickening, which I definitely need. As a, a woman of a certain age, I've noticed my hair thinning over time, so this will be fun to, uh, to test out. Um, it is sealed, so I don't want to quite open it yet, um, but I'm looking forward to trying this out. Next item out of the box is lemongrass, rosemary, and peppermint. It is by Murphy's Naturals, and it is a mosquito repellent balm. Um, I never see mosquitoes where I live, even though I've got a creek right behind me here on the other side of my uh, apartment complex's parking lot, and there's another one at the end of the block. I only have a two-block long street. Um, but Again, it's sealed. I don't want to open it, um, but it could come in handy. You never know. <laughs> but I bet it smells wonderful. Um, can't really smell anything. Everything still smells like the candle. <laughs> so very interesting. Um, Murphy's Natural Bug Bomb Mosquito Repellent Bomb can, contains all natural ingredients, including lemongrass, rosemary, peppermint oil, DEET-free, and made in the USA. Now, I love all those scents. There's nothing wrong with that. Lemongrass, check. Rosemary, check. Peppermint oil, definitely check. Um, I have a huge bottle of peppermint oil, essential oils in the bathroom, so love that. Love that. Something interesting um, and very unique. You're not going to find that in your normal subscription box, let me tell you. Um, next item is National Parks playing cards. 54 unique minimalist U.S. National Park designs included in a deck of collectible high quality playing cards. Um, I actually chose this because the other items within this level um, didn't appeal to me as much as, as this. I don't have a deck of cards. <laughs> I know. Um, and from what I understand, it is supposed to have um, little trivia bits about um, each of these um, parks on it. Um, retail value of $15. A deck of cards featuring U.S. national parks. Each suit represents a region, and parks are feature featured based on popularity. I am not an outdoor, outdoor girl, so I may never get to the national parks, though as someone who is disabled, I do get um, some discounts. I've just never done well in camping settings, so I get to learn a little bit about the parks from afar. So I'm happy with that. <laughs> uh, next item is Doana Orange and Cinnamon All Natural Skin Care Soap Bar. 100% handmade, made with olive oil, cold-pressed, palm oil free, and it's vegan. It's about three and a half ounces. So, love the scent of orange and cinnamon. Um, it is sealed. Let's see if I can break the seal easily. Not easily, because I cut my nails. Um, ooh, shapes. Shapes, shapes, shapes. Oops. So... It does not smell like cinnamon or orange. 
kind of smells like wax. So we will see how that goes. <laughs> um, yeah, um, it does. It does not smell very nice at all, actually. Sorry, but it doesn't. <laughs> I'm gonna put that one back in the box. Um, Dewana soap has a retail value of nine dollars. Handmade and cold pressed, all natural, organic soap bar that is vegan, palm oil free, antiseptic, antimicrobial. Scents will vary. Orange and cinnamon does not smell like orange and cinnamon in any shape or form. So. Um, that might go in a giveaway. <laughs> Next item is wrapped pretty heavily, and I'm pretty sure it is a room spray that there had been some discussion about. Um, this is Wild Rose, and I believe it has rose quartz crystals at the bottom. Um, formulated with Lebanese rose water and beautiful rose quartz, this inspired floral scent is intended to balance body and mind, soften and condition skin or spritz on linen, laundry, or furniture with the soothing notes of freshly blossomed rose. I'm just going to have to get a, uh, a regular mirror, not a makeup mirror. Sorry about that. I'm not going to redo the video. So let's... So. Oh, it does have a very true rose scent. Not just the rose flower, but the rose bush, like the stems and everything. So that is quite crisp. It's not just the soft scent of like rose petals. It's definitely got a, uh, a crispness to it. Very fine mist. That's nice and mild. I, I think that would be very nice, like sprayed on a pillow before you go to bed. I am not a fan of lavender, so rose would be a lot better scent for me. And uh, nice heavy glass, um, very cute packaging. I'm glad I got this. Um, there was one more scent, I believe. Um, let's see. Um, so the magic, which I'm all about magic. Crystal and essential oil infused skin or room spray used on furniture, clothing, or as skincare. Retail value of $15. So um, I'm all about crystals, so I love that um, it can be imparting uh, rose crystals. Rose quartz is actually good for emotional healing. It is good for self-love, and uh, I like this. It's very cute. Uh, getting to the bottom here something wrapped up. Aha, I remember the discussions about this. Let's go with this. This is a teeny tiny concrete match holder, which would go with the little blue candle. Um, little octagonal in shape. It's got a nice little bit of cork on the bottom, so it's not going to scratch uh, your tabletop or anything. And it has a match striker on the back of it as well, so that's very convenient. Um, I chose the um, white matches to go with it, so we've got a nice little box of wooden matches. No scent, that's good. Uh, let's see about this. Match Holder by Tennessee or Ten Prairie, T-E-N-N, -N, retail value of $22. Concrete match holder that makes it easy to strike a match comes with matches. $22 for a teeny tiny concrete match holder. Do I think that's a good value? No. Is it cute? Yes. But would I pay that if I saw it on the shelf anywhere else? No. Not at all. Not even with the matches, not even with the candle. Um, but it is very unique in its shape, and it's very cute. And again, once the matches are gone, I could put other things in here. I could put my rings in there for the night. Um, so it has many other uses, and it will get... Um, it could probably be a candle holder of other types of candles as well. Could put a little votive in here. Many other uses. 
and the last item, which is one of the ones that I was really hoping that would be chosen and that I would get. Um, it is a Rosemary Mint Body Cream. Let's see. Alrighty. Body Cream. Smoke and Mirrors Vegan Body Cream. Um, the options were Strawberry Cream Date Night Scent or Rosemary Mint. And I am so glad we got Rosemary Mint. <laughs> Um, I love this, both of those scents, so let me open this up. It is not sealed, so I've got to be very careful with this, um, and just put it on my little table here. Um, it would have been nicer if it had been sealed. Oh, God, that's lovely. That is divine, actually. Um, let me go ahead and rub it on the opposite wrist, since this one's taken up by Rose. Um... Very buttery, buttery, very creamy. It's a relatively strong scent, but I love the scent of mint and rosemary together. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Um, it's very full. <laughs> so I need to be very careful. Um, but I would have liked it better if it had been sealed. <laughs> um, overall, I think uh, the box cost me around $70 and that includes um, two-day shipping uh, as well that I opted for. Um, I'm not sure if there was tax or not. The The base price was $59.99. Um, but I did it since I tried to do a video of this earlier um, and messed it up. Um, I have had a chance to add up the value um, of this box. So about $140 worth of items for the cost of $70, and that, again, includes rush shipping. Um, I believe Jess is farther south in California than I am, or at least that's, I believe that's where the boxes came from, so um, I did get it very, very quickly. I'm looking forward to discovering more about Goldie Boxed in the next season. Usually my favorite season for um, subscription boxes, especially those that are lifestyles slash beauty oriented combined, is usually fall. So um, I'm looking forward to discovering what more she has to offer in the coming season. So I hope you all have enjoyed this little unboxing. Um, all of these opinions are mine. It is um, how I feel about everything. And um, if there's anything to review, I'll review it at another time. But I am delighted to try this. And um, I've seen so many videos and so many people are delighted with the products. She has done an inordinate amount of research on each project. And as a professional buyer, um, I appreciate all that she's done to find these very specific delightful items. And uh, yeah. I'm looking forward to the next one. So thank you everyone again for joining me in tonight's little chat and unboxing. If you uh, liked what you saw here, please give the video a thumbs up. Consider subscribing, hit the notification bell, and um, yeah, leave me a comment. I want to know, do you get Goldie Boxed? Have you heard of Goldie Boxed before? Um, leave me a comment. I love comments and I always reply. So have a good night, everyone. It is a special holiday weekend. So if you are celebrating, may you and your loved ones have an excellent time together. So be good to yourself and be good to each other. Thanks, everyone. Take care. Bye.